I can't believe how often we're uploading. back again another YouTube video never tell me the odds of that I couldn't come up with a better intro lightning strikes firework whoa is it real does that pop the firework that's insane should it still go somewhere though it hit that but it still needs to find ground it's not gonna find ground through that unless it hit the firework and then went down through the smoke and then hit the ground next to that and then whoever set off the firework it dead that's sick though. Thor was sick of you guys setting off fireworks. He's like 4th of July, more like 4th of shut up. Leaning forward right in the nick of time. Oh, that is insane. A fraction of a second. Like that's the difference between like, whoa, you'll never believe this too. Oh, now I'm in a hospital bed. Count your blessings. I'll tell you, it's not hard to count your blessings. You've won and it's life. Talk about luck. What? <laughs> That's awesome. The fact that you were recording that too. What a cute dog. You <laughs> That's sick. That dog should be in the Olympics. I think dogs should be allowed in the Olympics. Whoever agrees with me, like this video. That's how many people want dogs to be in the Olympics! I mean, what else are you gonna do? Dislike the video? You can't. Well, you can, but only I'm able to see it. And then what's the point? You lose all your power. <laughs> I had to take a picture of the rainbow and lightning struck at the same time. Jesus made it happen. Jesus is on the dash going, no worries. I saw you taking the camera out and I was like, oh, let's play around a little. <laughs> Boom! Lightning! I could just make that happen. That's where the pot of gold is. People actually think it's at the end of the rainbow, but the lightning struck the gold. Because... I don't think gold conducts electricity. <laughs> what leprechauns do! Mad conductive! Wanna see a magic trick? Whoa! <laughs> I've seen a bunch of these before in like meme compilations where something happens at the exact time. The dude even looks like he reacts to it. Nice, let's just keep watching this. Whoa! And again. again. Whoa! Sick. George Lucas walks into a random documentary. They're dissolving this thing <laughs> in a molten salt and they're doing electrochemistry on it. <laughs> Why don't they call it molten salt? Wow! I thought it was going to be scripted or maybe not him, but that is actually George Lucas. Also, I feel like George Lucas was born in these clothes. I think his mother had to push him out when he was wearing this shirt and jeans combo. I think all the changes is maybe his shoes. I feel like it's all he wears. He wears these shirts all the time. Respect, George. A fashion icon. He knows what he likes and he sticks to it. I'm getting that moment where you ever look at a celebrity too often, but then when you look at them long enough, you're like, you're different looking than I thought. <laughs> He's so different in real life. Whoa! The cat knocked my daughter's fishbowl off the dresser. The fact that it didn't shatter is surprising, but how did it manage to just turn over, get out some of the stones, and then not- That's insane. Never tell me the odds, am I right, gamers? I hope that there's somebody on the comments of every single one of these posts that tells you the exact odds of all of these. <laughs> Elevator party with a twist. Is it Bill Nye the science guy? I bet he could tell me the odds of that. He could tell me the odds right now of how, how likely it was that he would run in there. And he would probably say it's 100% odds because where he's going, the odds are always in his favor of where he's going to be. Damn, did I just do some science? I should become a science guy. Can't be that hard. Particles. Nuclei. Relativity. Science is so easy. Stephen Hawking had died on Albert Einstein's birthday. Whoa. Really? If it's there, I'm not gonna doubt you, but the internet has taught me that I should be vigilant. Yeah, 14th of March, 2018. 14, that was 1879, not 2018. Somebody in the comments who doesn't get how birthdays work is like, yeah, what a wise guy. <laughs> that is wild though, because Hawking also was in like the same sort of field. I don't know if exactly, but he did stuff on black holes a lot. And that's so intrinsically linked to relativity. 
I should be a science guy. Listen to the words that are coming out of my mouth. Oh, quarks, am I right? Cop said, if he made a half court shot, we could stay. I'm assuming he made the half court shot, because otherwise the odds are that you got kicked out of the basketball court. <laughs> That's so fun. Because you know what's gonna happen as well is that after they got that noise complaint and the cops came out, they're probably going to be quieter afterwards. Or twice as loud because now they can get away with anything because they're invincible! Turns out this is fake and the police were actually like, haha, yeah, but seriously, we gotta go, it's 11 p.m. My Coca-Cola bottle caps alphanumeric code was 69X prawn. Wow. <laughs> Do you think the robot who made that bottle cap, he was like getting close and close and close and then he just went, yeah! That's what I'm talking about, baby! Whoa! Bottle cap, yeah! I hope so. That's what I would do. Spectator taunts player hit by puck before getting hit by one himself. Did I? I feel like I've seen this. This is gonna be one of those things where someone's like, Jackie, you've responded to this already. <laughs> Whoopsies. <laughs> oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. Oh, there it is. Bonk. <laughs> oh, I wanted to see more. I want to see the player, like, rub it in. Oh. Oh, that would just really get me going. Just some like, cathartic experience, some schadenfreude. But I guess I'm not getting it. I guess I gotta squeeze my nipples to something else tonight. This is how the newspapers were stacked up at my new job. Does that say this is not a coincidence? <laughs> wow, <laughs> that's so cool. Man and woman will share board leadership of the organization. This is not a coincidence. Two paintballs colliding midair, but I can't see it. What are the odds of me not being able to see it? I'm just gonna Google it. Is it this? Whoa! Okay, that was tight. I like that one. 225 views. I don't know if that's the one, but I saw something now adhering to this title. So I am happy. I am appeased. Anybody else out there who thinks that that's underwhelming, I'm gonna come to your house and probably do nothing. Have a drink. 99, look. Ooh, Dark Souls, let's go. I know exactly what's gonna happen when it happens. You see, right, he had to fight him, and then that guy, and then up around here to the left, it's like where all the swingy blades are. Oh no, it's that guy in the left. I knew it. Oh! <laughs> no way! The amount of times when I played that game where they knocked me off all the way down into the pit. And what's worse is that I had enough health that in the pit I got back up. And then there's a bunch of oh, Titanite demons down there and they kill you because you have low health now. And then all your souls end up down there. Or you just have to walk your way out of that pit and then you're all the way back at square one. Oh, uncomfortable. But you, my friend, are sick. Let's see how much damage it took. Because he was about to get hit by lightning as well. Not that much. Not that fair play. Well done. Why are you wearing this crappy armor though? Level up! I've seen this one before, but I'll show it off anyway. <laughs> that guy is the coolest person on the planet for the five seconds that this was happening. I think there's some residual cool points in the world. When something cool happens to you, it's kind of like, like a dopamine release. He had like a good 20 minutes out of that. It's like aftershocks of an earthquake, like a couple of days later, he was like, <laughs> remember when I did that? I have no idea how earthquakes work. Hero bird saves guy from $300 fine. <laughs> Oh, that's so cool. As people would say these days, that's so based. What a based bird. Damn, what a homie. Except, it turns out there's a camera at the other side that just got his back license plate. Oh, I forgot that a lot, some places don't have those. I was so worried in America one time. Well, worried is an exaggeration. I was so mildly interested when I went to America one time and I realized, I think it was Florida I was in, that some of the cars didn't have license plates on them or they only had one or something like that. And I was like, wait, where's the license plate? And they're like, yeah, some states are just like, you only need it on the front or the back and that's it. I come from Ireland. You need a license plate front and back. You guys sport the law, you got not get in trouble. None of their feet are touching the floor. I feel like this would happen more often than not in a basketball game, right? There's a lot of running around. There's not that many players in basketball. But their feet are on the ground. Oh, foo! 
fooled you. What is this? Those are feet on the ground. You need to specify. None of their feet are touching the ground. The floor. You should say none of the people who are playing. I caught you. I caught you. You're gonna have to fork it over now. Fork it over. Fork over your Reddit card. Oh. That's your whole identity. Give it over. Summoning a friend. What is happening? I don't know what the end of this is gonna be. It just keeps going. Oh! <laughs> he just lodged one. <laughs> It's just, it's just harmless. That person down the street should stop them! They're gonna take over the world! It starts with one bin and then they hit a dump and then all the bins come out and start taking over the world. Although maybe that'd help because a lot of the world is trash right now. So, what goes in a bin? Take it away! Red Cross team accidentally captures a meteor. And none of you even realized. Sick. You turned around. I don't know why. The person over here turned around. That's insane. One of my hopes in life is that I will get to see something like that in real life. I was so obsessed with science and uh, space and all that stuff when I was a kid and like monster movies and meteors crashing into Earth and all that kind of documentary stuff. Anytime I see videos of it, I'm just like, whoa, that's so cool. Especially, they always seem to happen over Russia at nighttime. <laughs> Maybe I should just go to Russia for like a year, and eventually I'll see a meteor. Whoa. Are they blowing a coin? Oh my god. That's not what I would think they're doing if someone told me there was a bunch of lads in a room blowing. <laughs> that is insane. How many attempts? Never tell me the odds of that, bro. That is sick. Never tell me the odds that I will end this video right now.